welcome or welcome back to my channel welcome to another video today i have a very exciting planner sticker and other things haul for you i have some really exciting stuff here i think this is the last of my black friday stuff this is the third or fourth video of black friday hauls that i've got to show you we also have a couple of orders from planner face which i'm so excited about and some stuff i was sent from some really kind friends it's really hard to show everything in this uh, um like shot because there's a lot so let's get into it First up to nobody's surprise is Planner Face. I do PR for Planner Face, so you can use my code CAT to save 10% on your orders and add my name and notes to seller to pick up seasonal freebies, which I do have a couple of them here, so I'll talk about those when we get there. This is a mixture of things. Anna was in the UPS winter sale, so some of it is from that. Some of it is PR credit. Some of it is just general orders. <laughs> so just bear with me. Bit of a mixture, but I've just kind of merged everything together because I think it works better this way. And I do also have the January mystery, but I'll show that right at the end of the video with loads of spoiler warnings. So first up, we have the January order freebie. Obviously, you won't be able to pick this up now. I did have a second one of this and it just fell on the floor and I can't find it. So <laughs> hopefully that will turn up. Then I have just some of the old freebie sets. So these are no longer available, uh, but we've just got the doodles, the full boxes and the movie marquees. So my favourite three. But these are the ones that you can pick up at the moment, at least at the time I'm filming this. I don't really know when this video will go out because I'm very behind on editing at the moment. But these are the current freebies. I'm obsessed with this colourway, purple and yellow. Goes together so well. So I've got number one and number two as they are my favourite ones. Then I have my UPS freebies. So Anna does really, really generous tiered freebies for sales. So you have an all order freebie and then there's like 25, 50, 75, 100. Now it goes up to 125 or 150 or something like that um, for the winter sale. I think, I think I'm right in saying that. But this set, the art that Anna picked and basically the way that it works is the tiered freebies are all in a coordinating set and so the more you spend the more you get towards completing a set it's genius I love it but with this set the art that uh, Anna chose I helped her to pick is art that I've already had from other shops and I thought about still getting the freebies but I decided that it just wasn't what I needed I have done this spread before in a vertical planner and I don't see myself doing it again so I said to Anna that it was fine and she didn't need to send me the freebies she could keep them for other people save her printing extra but I did decide to still get the journaling freebie because I do have a functional planner now which I'm using journaling kits in and I'm obsessed with the journaling kit for this so I did get the journal but I didn't get the others so that's just to let you know why <laughs> it maybe looks a little bit weird the journaling freebie is new for this sale and I am so excited that this is going to be a staple going forward because oh it's so beautiful so first up we've just got the all order freebie which Anna did still send to me probably mostly because it's got movie markings on it but anyway let's focus on the journaling kit so this art set was drawn by Kitnish Jess a couple of years ago and it's this gorgeous like moon cafe like celestial cafe it's so beautiful and as I say I have done this spread before so I know how cute it is but in journaling I'm so excited it's beautiful so okay so this was 30 pounds um freebie for that so yeah i'm just so excited to use that in my journaling well it's not a journaling planner but like my functional planner so then we have stuff from the various orders so before we get into the kits let's do the other things so i have got a couple of doodles so the shop that releases the doodles that anna uses finally released a wedding set we've been waiting for the wedding set for so long and finally it's out so of course i had to pick up a couple of those sheets so we've got the ring sheet which does really look like my ring to be fair um and then we've also got this one which is the like sampler sheet so yeah so excited to finally have those and then i've picked up two sheets of of date dots because I exclusively use planner face date dots in fact these dates version 2 in my planner and I what annoys me about date dots is that I always end up with like dates that I'm missing like particular days of the month like 13 is a common one I'm often missing so I have to get through like multiple sets so I picked some more of those up okay let's get into the kit so Anna does do a few different kit sizes so she has standard vertical which is what I purchase there is also mini kit and then she does have journaling for a lot of sets not all of them come in journaling but you can get journaling in a lot of the sets now so these are mostly 
standard vertical but I do have some journaling kits as well because as I say I'm in my journaling kit era so first up we have the Mother's Day set I love this I really 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 like this set I love that we're kind of representing three different generations in this I just think it's so cute I don't know when I'll use this I'm not seeing my mum for Mother's Day this year because she's away on holiday when I said this to her she was like oh I didn't even realize so yeah I won't actually see my mum this year and we're celebrating uh, the week after, but we're going to a Beauty and the Beast afternoon tea again. We did it last year as well. So I have a kit I want to use for that. So I don't think I will use this this year. I think I will probably save it, but I just think it's absolutely adorable. And this does sort of look like my mum. I mean, I wish I looked like her, but it does sort of look like my mum. So yeah, really, really cute. So I won't dwell too long on the format because it's the same format as we've shown multiple times. So <laughs> I won't spend ages on it but oh look at the bomb she that's so cute so in terms of the extras that we have here so anna is very generous with the freebies that she gives with kits and then i do pick up some extras as well so freebies with the kit where this one which is the alternate skin tones of the box from the front page as well as the like little baby with the legs so cute and then we've also got the doodles and deco and then i picked up both sets of toolboxes because i i'd got to a point where i kind of realized i would probably be saving this for if i become a parent and i obviously have no idea of what children are or child or whatever i will have so i just pick up everything so that i have all the options you know so i've picked up both of those so cute i definitely think you could also use this though for like if you are like an auntie or anything like that because it's just super cute kids and stuff you know and i'm trying to think like only really like this box says mother's day but you could also use this to like celebrate if it's like your mum's birthday and all your family are together and all of your like nieces and nephews and stuff are there i think that would still be really cute and then i've also got their glitter ad on there as well so that is mother's day these should all still be in the shop by the way or at least most of them because they are all newer kids so next up we have i bought both <laughs> I bought both, obviously. So Kittenish Jess released this like planning, office, working set. And Anna did both of them uh, because we just couldn't pick. Like Anna doesn't always do both colorways of Jess sets. Like Jess has got a set coming up in a few weeks time. And Anna and I have already spoken about which set she's going to do. So it's not the case that Anna always does both. But she just could not choose <laughs> between these two. And she's done them in a way that I think that they lean really different vibes. So I picked up both because <laughs> I just couldn't resist. So the first one, the, the set is called Dream Plan Do, but this is the cool version. And this is the like blue and yellow version. If you know anything about me, you will know that blue in yellow is one of my favorite color combinations if not my favorite my branding colors are all in blue and yellow i love blue and yellow and i just think this is adorable i love the fact that jess has drawn a stanley like <laughs> my stanley is right here i don't have one with the like big handles because i take it to work but i do have a stanley and i love that it's got like the vlogging camera and it's got oh, it's got like the washi and the planners and the pens it's just so cute i love the fashion people in this set jess is my favorite planner artist as we all know and oh, she just smashed it like all the fashion people in this are beautiful and yeah i really love this i'm so glad that anna did both because if anna had picked one she would have done the pink and purple because purple is anna's color and i was so fine with that i love the pink and purple but the blue and yellow one is more me so the fact that she couldn't decide did benefit me and i just bought both so the freebies for this one there are so many right if you pick up this spread you can definitely do it over multiple weeks it would be very easy to do because there are so many freebies so we've got the alternative of the person with like the blaze this is so in this look i wish i could pull it off i wish i was cool enough to pull off a blazer look uh but carrying like the iced coffee we've got the alternate skin tones right in the to-do list and with the vlog camera and then the alternatives of that fashion person on the second page this is a million percent an outfit i would wear i'm really into uh i have like some pinafore dresses i got from simply be i think or yours and i have like the roll neck so i would 100 percent wear this outfit this looks a lot like me just i have curly hair and then we've got the doodle and deco i then picked up the toolbox because i think this is maybe my favorite fashion person in the set this is a million percent an outfit i would wear <laughs> like this is how i dress when i'm at home just completely obsessed and then we've also got the glitter sampler there as well i've been very good and i've picked up everything i think for these ones I've been very organized so yeah so thrilled to have 
that kit and then we have the cute version in pink and purple and i just feel like it still gives different vibes like anna has still leaned into different items we've got like the hand holding up the planner we've got the bag and the pens we've got different planner flat lays like anna's done such a good job at making the set different and the toolbox is not this one this time it's like the iced coffee person so i think uh so it just works so well i just love it and like even if we look at like the difference i, I assume jess must have drawn like with different art so the set is just really different feels you know so if you did want to pick them both up i'm just saying i think they're really different and she's even like flipped this person which i love so yeah i'm so excited i don't know which one i'm going to use this year i want to definitely use one of them this year but i'm not sure which one yeah i'm still on the fence i might use one in january i'm filming this on like the 11th of february or something embarrassing I'm very behind at the moment in life um but i so i haven't planned out all of my january kits so i may see if i can fit this one in so again we have got very generous add-ons we've got the alternative skin tones for like the planner and the to-do list oh, my favorite one <laughs> but to be honest i love them all but i just think i think this one just tips it i just think she's so cute um but yeah so we've got that one we've got the alternates look at that pink I'm crying. I'm crying. Look at it. And then we've got the doodles and deco. We've got the toolbox. So you can really get the full sense of that like blazer suit ensemble. Stunning. And then I've got the glitter sampler as well. So yeah, fave, fave, fave. Some of my peak kits of this year and it's like only 10th of Feb. Then we have this kit, which is XOXO. This is art by Lavi, who I absolutely love as well. I love Abby's art. And we have a very exciting kit from Lavi coming later this year. I'm not going to say anything else because I'm not allowed to, but I'm really excited about it. But yeah, this is Lavi's Valentine's set for this year. And there was quite a lot of Valentine's art this year. So I had to be a little bit choosy about what I picked up because we all know I have too many kits. And this just piqued it for me because the colours are like nothing I've ever seen before. I've, I don't think I've ever seen like pink, orange and is this the colour you would call lemongrass? I don't know. But I've never seen those together in a set. So you know me. If there is a unique colour combo, I've got to have it. And I love the fashion people, of course, because it's lavy. I also love that this is all you need is love and desserts. This is my motto for life. <laughs> it's so true. So yeah, I'm just obsessed with this. I'm still trying to weigh up what Valentine's kit I'm going to use for this year because I still haven't used the Kitnish Jess Romeo and Juliet art. Uh, so I'm still like weighing up what I'm going to use. We're not doing masses of Valentine's this year. Last year we did a lot for Valentine's. Um, but this year we're not doing so much because we have a wedding to pay for. So <laughs> we're not doing as much, but we are going out to dinner. So we'll see. Uh, let me come back to all of the extras. So this is a recolor of the Valentine set that Lavi did for 2023. It had this bed and it, I loved it. I think it's so smart to recolor it because it looks really different. And again, we can really see all of the colors and all of the patterns. <laughs> Butterwashy. Look at the bottom washi. So, okay, in terms of extras, so uh again, super generous set. So we've got the doodles and the deco. We've got the freebie add-on. So I love it when we have fashion people that could represent me and Stuart. I don't like to say that fashion people are one particular gender, but you identify as the gender you feel you should be. But I lean female, Stuart leaves male. So I kind of look for fashion people that could represent us. This could easily be me. I wear my hair in plaits a lot because I have very long curly hair like this person and my hair is all over the place. So this could easily be me. Stuart is maybe not quite as <laughs> quite as fashion forward as this gentleman, but this could definitely be Stuart. So I think that that is like, uh, that's kind of what swayed me to picking up this one because it just reminds me of me and Stuart. So I did also pick up the 15 millimeter because this rainbow pattern, I love it, but it's very bold. So I thought I might split it up with the heart. That might look a bit weird though, because it's obviously meant to be like a full rainbow. Um, so I'm not sure, but this is a kit because of how many add-ons there are that would last me multiple spreads. So having the 15 millimeter is no bad thing. And then I did also buy the toolbox add-on because I love a toolbox, especially when it's in a cute coral ensemble. So I had to pick that up. 
And then I've also picked up the glitter add-on for that as well. So very, very, very cute there. I am obsessed with every single one of these spreads. I feel really invigorated with my planner today, which is great because I haven't felt this way in a little while. My depression is like quite strong at the moment. We're not going to go into it, but I am really like excited by planning today. I need to tidy my house, but we'll overlook that. So those are the full kits. And then I do have some journaling kits as well. So I did pick up both of the, the Kitness Jess ones because even though in the main I'm thinking about trying to prioritize buying journaling kits of kits I'm not buying full kits for but that is so not always the case <laughs> just to let you know in fact I think it leans more not the case than it does the case but that is kind of the aim is like I might try and prioritize picking up journaling kits with art I didn't get in the full kits but I couldn't not get these I think they will be perfect in my functional planner because they lean so like officey and working and that is obviously my vibe and again i love that anna has like done the different people on both so it's got really different vibes <sighs> look at the stanley um it, they, they you know they have different clip art elements so again if you have both like it still works really well so yeah so cute i can't wait to use those i did have to pick up sunshine daisy because <laughs> this is art by nella who i also absolutely adore and you know, this is cat in a in an aesthetic. It's it's Daisy, which is also my brand. It's blue and yellow, and I love it. And I love these fashion people. This looks a lot like my hair as well. So I am so excited. So I've picked this up in the journaling kit so far. I actually think I love the journaling kit even more than the full kit in this one, but I do still need to pick up the full kit, but so cute and then i also picked up like a rose which was jess's valentine's art for this year which i have decided not to pick up in full kit not because i don't love it because jess is super talented as we all know jess is my fave <laughs> uh but the kit leans more like modern and based on like as i say there were so many valentine sets that came out this year the lavi one reminded me so much of me and stuart i couldn't not get it whereas this one like i will never look as fabulous as either of the, either of these people so but having this in my journaling um uh, well my like functional planner will be so cute so where we are now i'm going to be using this for this week because this is valentine so i that's why i actually wanted to film this haul today even though i don't think you'll see this haul for a while but i needed to use this kit so <laughs> that's why it's there and then i also picked up winter warmth which was art by darcy Again, I didn't pick this one up in the full kit, though Anna did a spread with this and it was so cute. Uh, but I didn't pick it up, but I loved the journaling kit version of it. So I picked that up as well. And I don't know whether I'll use it now or save it. I mean, it snows in March usually here. So I guess I'll probably use it in March. <laughs> so that is everything from planner phase, apart from the January mystery, which I'll show you right at the end of this video. Next up, we have Squirrel Prince Co. So I've got a few bits. I do also have the, I think it's also the January mystery from Squirrel Prince Co. But again, I'll show you that at the end of this video. So first up, we have this. Uh, okay, so this, now we're getting into mostly stuff from the States. So this is my remaining Black Friday orders. I think this will be all of them now <laughs> shipped here. This is probably the third haul I've included Black Friday stuff in. It's really gone on a while. So first up, we have the Cyber Monday 2024. I only ordered once. I didn't get the Cyber Monday mystery this year because I just couldn't afford to get everything. Um, I think the kit's really cute, but I didn't I didn't pick it up. Uh, but this so there were like two versions of the freebie because one was a Cyber Monday exclusive, but or the other way around. No, I ordered on Cyber Monday. So there must have been a Black Friday one <laughs> as well. Anyway, there were two freebies. I only have one of them, but it's a cute like winter doodle set. I got a couple of character doodles. Hilarious story about this. So I ordered from Squirrel Prince Co. last week or the week before because she re-released the book mystery from 2023, which is like one of my favourite kits of all time. And I completely forgot that I'd ordered the Wally stickers and I picked them up again. <laughs> So I will now have two sheets of Wally. It's not a film I particularly rewatch. Like I love Wally, right? The first 30 minutes of Wally, I think, are like movie perfection. After that, I think it loses its way a little bit. Not as much as Up does, but it does lose its way a little bit. But I don't need this many. Anyway, but the reason I picked these up is because these are two of the characters in Disney Dreamlight Valley, which is a video game that I do play. So I'll probably use these to mark <laughs> playing Dreamlight Valley. So we've got uh, Remy from Ratatouille. The TikTok Ratatouille musical, if you have not seen it, please do me a favour and watch it. It was like one of the, well, it, no, it was the best thing to come out of the pandemic was the Ratatouille TikTok musical. We still listen to the soundtrack at least once a week. <laughs> it's, it plays in our cart all the time. So please check that out if you haven't already. But yeah, so I picked those up. 
Then we have some kits. So first up, I have Lilac Woods. This is, so Jess, we love Jess, Jess did three different sets in this theme. So there was an autumn one, a winter one, and a spring one. And I picked up the autumn one and I did that in my planner in 2022. And then I accidentally got sent the winter one and I used that in my 2023 planner and I was obsessed with it. It, I, have I'm so glad that I got sent it accidentally by Andrea because it's a spread it's one of my favorite spreads to be honest of 2023 uh I I didn't realize I would love it as much as I did so because of that I was like I have to pick up lilac woods I can't not get it because I know how cute the other two spreads looked and the colors are all so different so yeah I finally picked up lilac woods I do already have the add-ons for this like in my kit album somewhere this is the gorgeous spring version. It's got like this beautiful lilac wood, hence the name. Really like fairy tale esque. It was originally inspired by uh, the Rings of Power, Lord of the Rings. But now I think this one is based off The Last Unicorn, which I haven't read. I don't know what that is. Uh, but obviously it has a unicorn. I have no idea when I would use this. Okay. I don't know yet. I'm very particular about when I use kits. So I'll save this one for a while. So we've got the freebie there. This is the mini kit version. I do tend to pick up the mini kits from SPC just because the pound to the dollar right now is so not in the favor of the pound. Like it really used to be. It used to be that like we could pick up stuff from the States and it was like, I, I don't know how to describe the maths, but you would save like 50% or something. Like it was really, really good, but it's not now. So I have to limit what I pick up. So I do just pick up the mini kits, which is not enough stickers for me, even with add-ons, but it's fine. I have a lot of extras. Bottom washy there. So yeah, very cute don't know when I'll use it but I'm very glad to finally have it then I have this one which I think is called breakfast in bed I can't read this in the current lighting that I'm in but I'm pretty sure it's breakfast in bed this was exclusive art for mother's day in 2023 and I just really like it I don't think I will use it for mother's day though because I don't think it it screams mother's day which is I mean that as a good thing I have a lot of other mother's day kits as we've just seen so I am going to use this probably for just a hotel stay because I think it really screams like luxury hotel. Uh, not sure when I'll ever be able to afford going to a luxury hotel again, but I think that's what we'll use it for or going away like to a cottage or something like that. And I do already have the add-ons for this. Oh, that's really cute because it's got like presents and stuff. So yeah, maybe for a birthday as well. But obviously you definitely could use it for Mother's Day. So I think that's really cute and I do already have the add-ons and I loved the fashion people for that one. Then I have Trick or Treat. This is art by Kitness Jess that wasn't exclusive, but Andrea brought it back. I did have this art from Planner Face at the time, but I was still in a horizontal planner then. And it's just one of my favorite sets that I think would look so cute in a vertical planner. So I picked it up again, which I don't always do, but I did think I would pick this one up. I do already have the add-ons for this one as well, somewhere in one of my albums. I think I will be saving this one for if I have children because it just leans so like having kids really and as I say I have done this one before so leaving like a bit of time between me using it I mean I last used it in like 2018 but <laughs> it's probably good to leave it but this one is just adorable and I loved the colors I love the toolbox I don't think that that was in the version I had from Anna um but yeah as I say this was a spread I just remember really loving in my vertical planner so I wanted to pick that one up then we have snuggle season which was also some kitness jess art i'm really loving that andrea is on a re-release of all the art jess has previously done kick because it means i can pick up ones that i didn't have or like exclusives that andrea had that she's reformatted so uh, i don't think andrea watches my videos but andrea if you do i love it or jess if you could pass on to andrea that i'm loving her doing it so this one i love this there are so many christmas kits in this haul by the way i set for christmas kids kits for like 10 years at this point but i love the color of this like it's so different with like the teal and the kind of like deep red cranberry red maybe so I just think this is absolutely beautiful I'm so obsessed I love the fashion person like so cozy and for the extras I did pick up fan box three I don't know if there were alternatives of this person I didn't pick them up if they were which has annoyed me a bit because she has red hair and like it so it's not gonna match the others but I'm, I'm I'm sure it was either not an option or I just chose not to pick up. The add-ons are gone from shops, so I can't check. 
but my head i have had red hair before like i'll be fine um but yeah i love the onesie here and i love the kid boxes in this as well so cute then we've got the add-ons because i say i do pick up the mini kits so i do have the add-ons we've got this cute like hanging the merry oh, i love this kit i just i really 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 like the colors like a lot a lot a lot so very excited to have that one and then i think last up from spc yeah uh, apart from the january mystery is christmas baking everyone loved this set this was andrea's exclusive christmas set for this year which is art by dusk i i'm pretty sure it's dusk and i love dusk's art and this fashion person this is a hundred percent me like my hair always looks like that you know i have curls everywhere um so i just love this and i love that it's got this like christmas baking flat lay and this gorgeous kitchen i think this is so cute <laughs> i really 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 like it so i do have fam three my only thing is i don't like toolboxes that are this zoomed in because i don't think that they go with other boxes um and that's like for all shops i'm not a massive fan of it but um so i will probably use the redhead one but i wanted to pick it up because this is the one that most looks like me and then it's got a cute kid box as well and then i've got two of the label add-ons uh, their freebie is another food flat lay with the cookies so cute and then this is the rest of the kit oh, i love this art oh, is so well drawn like it's so intricate so that's beautiful and i think i need to find some matte bronze foil i think to go with that one because i think that's what will work best so yeah that is everything from spc apart from the january mystery which i'll show at the end of the video so next up we have a new to me shop but a shop that i have been waiting to buy from for a long time this is lina designs and i had this like ongoing black friday list from lina designs for most of 2023 and i've even started my like 2024 decisions of what i'm gonna buy so yeah i'm i'm really really excited to have these because these are kits i've been wanting for a long time so i'm very excited and uh, if you like mysteries, exclusive art, uh, Linen Designs covers both of those. And if you like pop culture kits, Linen Designs has really good pop culture kits. Most of them are drawn by Nella, who does an amazing job with them, as we all know. So really recommend. So first up, we have a business card. This has a code on it. So I'll leave that for now. Uh, then these are the Black Friday freebies. So we have this one from Mick Plans, who I do follow on YouTube. We have this one from Christiane Planner, which is a proud member of the Naughty List Club, which is probably not me uh, as a very straight-laced person. Uh, we've got this one, which is from Planning with Terriel, who I've not heard of, but cute script font and then from plan with me stickers this one which says you're doing amazing sweetie which is in like a pink pink wave maybe um plan with me stickers is a very popular foil shop um i've just not bought from them but yeah i think that's pink wave and then from carly plans we have these christmas doodles very cute carly's paper is very interesting it's very vinyl-y yeah it's very interesting um so those were the like shop sale like shop freebies and then from lina designs we have this november freebie this is like one of the characters that she has in her shop very cute this is a 35 dollar freebie which are some scripts which i think would be very good for like a weekly spread if you mark work every day which i don't but those are there uh this one i'm absolutely obsessed with this is the black friday freebie i am obsessed with these hedgehogs i need more of the hedgehogs <laughs> we have this one which is a 35 dollar freebie as well very cute like romancy font oh yeah for valentine's day that's really cute then this one which is a 50 dollar freebie which is a valentine's freebies in i'm pretty sure this is red it'll maybe be more obvious to you than in my lighting but i think this is red but it's like a deep red it's not like a bright bright red that's very cute anyway i doubt i have anything that goes with it but it's very cute and then this is a 50 dollar freebie as well which is a silver foil pot moshi always very handy to have so yeah very usable freebies there in general i would say so let's get into the kit so first up we have crime junkie so i'm not into true crime <laughs> uh my best friend emma is like very into true crime so i could use this for emma's birthday but i do not i'm not interested in any kind of true crime i do not feel a need to consume this type of content like i don't watch the news for example i don't like things that are this negative it does not interest me but a i love this art i think this is some of like this is maybe one of my favorite if not favorite fashion person that nella's ever done so i had to get it for that reason but also i really really love only murders in the building the show so i feel like this could really work for marking only murders i don't know when the next season is coming i'm sure we are getting another one um so i might use it for that if nothing else is on in that week 
because it's one of my favorite shows of all time so yeah that's just the explanation there of why i got this but yeah i think this is so cute and as i say this fashion person i just i've always been obsessed with this fashion person this was one of the first if not the first exclusive art set that lina did and i i just it's the person it's the person for me that really sells it so i don't know off the top of my head the different kit formats that lina has so i can't tell you which one this is unfortunately uh, she does also usually have foil bundles that are themed and match i've only picked up one of those just because you know i was shopping from a lot of places in black friday i can't buy everything so i've only picked up one but you can usually get a coordinating foil bundle so here we have the box add-on I don't know whether she had a more brunette version, but this hair looks like almost black, which I'm like, <laughs> fashion people are why I buy kits, okay? This is my favourite part of, of kits. Um, I think I will use the blonde one. I think the blonde one just matches the spread personally perfectly, even though usually I would use the one that looks most like me. But it came with loads of extra boxes, so it's obviously very useful anyway um i like this getting loser we're solving all cases very mean girls the colors of this kit are very bright they are very out there the patterns are very out there uh so i don't actually know how this will look laid down to be honest but i had to get it i had to and we've got the deco here my my only like comment would be that i would like more deco smaller like there's a lot of in my opinion white space here that could be used with smaller deco because i put my deco along the top of a spread so i would personally prefer smaller deco because i'm gonna have to cut so much of this off i would prefer smaller deco and more of it but yeah that's like really my only my only comment about that so that kit is called crime junkie that's the first one then i picked up hallmark this is also exclusive art but this is art by lavi i think and i had to get this because i love hallmark christmas movies okay i did not watch enough of them in 2023 2022 i went on a real binge and like on new year's eve i was sick and couldn't celebrate and i watched like seven um christmas, <laughs> christmas movies back to back so i love a hallmark christmas movie and me and my friend emma it's like what we do every year we have like a christmas movie day and we sit and just plan all day and watch christmas movies so i will be using this for mine and emma's uh christmas movie marathon hopefully this year and it's it's i have this mug that this exact mug i have it me and emma both have it i bought it for her <laughs> and unfortunately we don't get the hallmark channel in the uk that's like one of the most devastating things in life to me is that we don't get the hallmark channel because there are so many good hallmark movies and every year on my like facebook feed it comes up with all of the hallmark movies that are coming out and launching this year and like i can never watch them but you can get like a hallmark add-on to amazon prime and i think the movies come out like a year later on there so hopefully i can watch them a year later and I'll try and be more dedicated this year. But yeah, I just think this is so cute. Yeah, lovey. So these are the, the add-on. Again, the hair is more black than brown. But my hair is like quite dark. But yeah, I love this. This is such a cozy vibe. So cute. We've got the bottom washi. And this has got like a Mariah Carey CD in it. Um, yeah, so cute. I love the patterns. I love the colours. Very cute. Very traditional Christmas with that one. So that is Hallmark then we have district 12 look i could not pick this up okay so i am still not seeing ballads of songs of snakes songbirds and snakes um because stuart has never watched the hunger games films so we haven't yet to watch ballads of songs of birds and snakes because stuart wants to watch the hunger games films first even though ballads of songs of snakes is a prequel but i i don't know because obviously to me hunger games is like part of my um dna but um for stuart he's like it probably doesn't make sense to watch the prequel first so i'm hoping that we can do a hunger games movie marathon day maybe maybe i'll suggest it to our friendship group because we have a group of friends where we like binge movies sometimes so maybe i could suggest hunger games i do also have the box set and i'd really like to reread them so uh yeah i got like the special edition um box set from i can't remember which shop i got them from now scholastic i think uh but yeah i do have that as well and i think nella did such a good job with this art it's so absolutely hunger games you know so i just i had to get it okay <laughs> i had to i love the patterns i love the colors i love everything about it <laughs> i'm just so excited um i like the deco as well it's a bit smaller so i think that will work well so this is the one i picked up the matching foil bundle for because i 
look at the look at the underlays i could not okay so and it has the may the odds be ever in your favor so i can't remember what color i picked them up in now bronze but i don't know if it's bronze but anyway this one is like the one i picked it up in um because i felt like it brought out the browns in the kit because obviously the green the kit's very green so i thought that going with like a contrasting foil would work well um i don't i'm pretty sure i was able to choose the foil color and yeah this is the four boxes i loved it i really actually really like lina's foil bundles i think they're very sensible like how she's laid them out they're very usable for me i'm, I'm just obsessed like we've got the little mocking j pin just throughout so yeah it, the main reason is i just couldn't not get the patterned underlays i'm not really a pattern underlays person you know give me a confetti like bougie box any day but these peak um then we've got the gorgeous bottom washi as well and then the like functional page i think feel like the lines of these are very thick on this like i don't think i would use those they're i think that they're just like it's very strong but i don't really use ford icons much anyway so but yeah love that that's district 12 and then the last kit is lifestyle this is also exclusive art by lavi this is like fitness clean eating type thing um i'm on an endless journey for this sort of thing um and i really like these sorts of kits even though i don't think i've made nearly enough strides in my life um in in these um these goals but I do really like the set and it's drawn by Lavi and I love Lavi. So, so yeah, here we have the add-on boxes. So, I mean, if, <laughs> if I could ever look like this, wow. Um, but yes, yeah, so I just really, I love the fashion people and I love that we've got like a bit of a mixture of fashion people. We've got somebody who's like probably kind of like eating more protein and trying to build to like weights and stuff. It's just really cute. And I did pick up the giant box, um, because I liked that this person was running and I will probably trim this to a toolbox like I I don't use this size of box like the glam planner size box but I think I will trim that to just be an additional toolbox there we've got the spin bike I do own a spin bike that looks like a peloton I don't have a peloton uh, but I do have a spin bike which I can no I still can't reach it <laughs> it's in the corner of my room and I'm blocked in currently by my treadmill yeah ongoing anyway I'm not going to talk about it too much because I get kind of worked up about it but anyway very cute love all the smoothies because i'm a smoothie person so yeah i thought that was really cute and i love because it has like the the lavy fashion people so yeah that is everything from lina designs then we have another new shop to me but not somebody who is new to me this is from alicia craft i watch most of alicia's youtube videos so when alicia she has predominantly foil that she does and again i don't pick up much like themed foil it's just not the area of planning that i choose to spend my money on but she released an exclusive art kit drawn by Nella. <laughs> so had to have it. So in terms of the freebies, so we've got this one, which is this silver kind of uh cute like I can't think of the, I can't think of the word right now, but cute fashion. Um cute for elements. Oh my word, my brain's slowing down. This one's so cute. It's a gold sparkle, let it snow. Very cute. And then Alicia must have been in like the same um shop sampler swap as uh Lina because we've got this which is just a smaller version of the christmas doodles from carly plans we've got that same proud member of the naughty club was the other one in a different foil though was the other one in gold yes the other one was in gold so this one is in sparkly hollow i think hard to tell in my lighting and then we've got that same like pink wave you're doing amazing sweetie one from plan with me stickers so yeah this is the kit it's called bookish christmas so you know i had to pick it up this is me in a kit i think um i love that we've got all the animals the books just like i love reading okay <laughs> so yeah i love the fashion people in this so cute i love this one which is like cuddling the cat sat on the the chair this is like bell goals you know look at the little santa hat i was obsessed i really 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 like this kit so the freebie add-on is a different skin tone of the person there and then this is the, uh, I'm pretty sure I purchased this, the like fam add-on. So we've got this like <laughs> kind of Mrs. Claus outfit holding the books. This one I love because it's very rare to get curly haired fashion people 
with my skin tone. Uh, like often they have straight hair or wavy hair, but like my hair is that type of curly. It's a lot longer, but it's that type of curly. So I really like that. We've also got another double box. Like this would last for easily two weeks with all of these boxes. Very cute. So I don't know Alicia's format, I guess. Well, I don't know Lina's either, but I just flicked through it without looking properly. Um, this one has a lot of boxes. So that's really useful. So we've got like the plane and the patterns. Really cute there. And then we've got another doggy um and then a, that's a very strong bottom washi um i probably could have done with a plain one um but, but this kit is going to be so bright anyway <laughs> like, i don't think it matters um because it's going to be it's just so bold but yeah i love it i love the art i think nella's done a really good job i think alicia had like the plan of people in mind when she thought of this set so yeah i really really love this one so that is the only thing i picked up because as i said alicia does really really cute themed foil it's just not where i uh spend my planning money but yeah you should definitely check it out and that is everything from alicia craft okay now let's do rose colored days um because i just picked up just a few bits sorry for the opening of the fellow should have done this with the camera um so these are yeah i mean you can see what they are it's just some overlay tapes so we've got this which is a red clear foil i will just rak that i think that's the business card and then i will just never understand why people do calendars as freebies i just i don't get it because they don't do them like two or three months in advance so i can't use them because i'm international but anyway that's that um yeah and then i just picked up some bougie box tapes because i sorry <laughs> sorry 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 for those of you listening on headphones um so i use uh bougie box overlay tapes well like they're not overlay tapes they're underlay tapes um i use them a lot i it's a cheaper way of using foil than buying loads of foil bundles and i i'm getting through a lot of them and nobody else sells them anymore <laughs> and these are on sale so i have a feeling that rose colored days is also discontinuing them so i will have to switch to just buying from four bundles now that anna has foil uh it makes it a lot easier for me because it means i don't have to pay us shipping on foil so um yeah this it will probably be much easier for me now because anna also released like just the um bougie boxes that's not what she calls them but the like underlay tapes the underlay boxes sorry on their own so it is going to make my life significantly easier now that Anna does foil, but I ordered these before Anna released the foil. So yeah, we have one in silver, one in hollow, and one in light gold, because they're the three that I was most running out of. Like, if I show you my light gold and hollow, <laughs> we were getting desperate, okay? So yeah, I just picked up some more of those. Um, and that was it. That was everything, <laughs> everything I picked up from Rose Colored Days. So now we have an order from Simply Gilded. Um, this was a little bit of a rogue purchase, to be honest. I'm not sure that this was in Black Friday. This might have been after Black Friday. Um, I love my Simply Gilded albums. I have these. Um, I have four of them and I love them, right? I love you open them up and you can flick through and you can see all your stickers. And I, I really, really, really like them. And these two were on sale. So <laughs> what can I do? I'm looking at my shelves currently and I have no room for any additional albums, right? I have not, not one space for an additional album on my shelves. Um, so that's going to be fun for uh for this afternoon's cat to figure out what we're going to do with that but i i love these albums so much and i couldn't resist picking them up i'm gonna need to decide what i use them for as well i think one of them i'm just gonna use for book stickers because i have so many um but i need to really think about my um my planner uh functional sticker storage right now so i'll be doing a bit of that this afternoon but anyway we have this is the freebie which is a very cute pattern like tartan i don't particularly use these but i think they're really cute cute tartan bow that's not tartan that's plaid i think maybe anyway and this is the journaling card cute i won't keep it but cute um so let me show you the albums i haven't opened them yet because i wanted to do it with you on camera which um for those of you with headphones you'll be like for goodness sake cat couldn't you couldn't you have opened them yourself um so um i can't remember the colors of these because it doesn't say uh, but she does have a few different sizes of albums i get the large ones um because i just they're just perfect like they fit two quarter sheets really well in each one uh oh sorry 
I could cut this out, but I'm not sure I want to edit that much. Um, okay, so yeah, these are the two I got. So this one is a blue one with silver hollow stars. So cute. And it's white cream inside. And then these are all the plastic wallets. Just, I really, really love the Simply Gilded albums. I really, really, really love them. Um, and I... I can't overstuff them, which is probably a good thing for me. And then this one is a gorgeous plaid. So cute. And this is a gold heart. Pink inside. Absolutely beautiful. So yeah, I love, love, love these two. I'm so glad that these two are on sale. I will probably keep my eye out for more if they're on sale. And not that I think they're outrageously expensive for what they are. Uh, it's just, you know, I have to ship them. And shipping them is expensive, but I love them. So I picked those ones up on sale. So that is everything from Simply Gilded. Now I have a couple of bits which are RAKs that were sent to me from amazing people in the planner community. So first up, a massive shout out to Laura Rose Plans who uh, reached out to me because she saw that I have this kit from Glam Planner. It's um, one of the winter mysteries. And she was like, oh, I've already done the spread and I have these extras. Do you want them? Um, and she sent them to me for free. So thank you, Laura, because she knows that I love having extras because I make kits last multiple weeks. Oh, I'm just remembering how gorgeous this art is. So yeah, so cute. Oh wow, there's so many extras in here, Laura. Thank you. Oh my word, so excited. So yeah, big shout out to Laura who very kindly sent me those. Um, and then a big shout out to Tammy as well from Recovery Planning. So um, Tammy reached out to me and was like, I'm getting rid of some stuff. Do you want them? And she had loads of stuff that I use. I mean, Tammy knows my planning style really well anyway. So she knew the sorts of things I would want. And she sent me all of these for free as well. So Tammy, thank you, because this is so generous. And when I opened this card, I was, I cried. I was like, this is so lovely. So I won't like show you the inside of the card, but just a massive shout out to Tammy for sending me this stuff. So there was more than I expected as well, because she also sent me some like smaller kits to use in my planners, which because she knows from a video I mentioned about my functional planner. So I had no idea she was going to do that. I'm getting emotional again. Thank you, Tammy. It's so cute. So first up, we've got the true crime one from Planner Phase, which again, as I said, I'm not into true crime, but I'm very into only red is in the building and so this is going to be perfect for using in my functional planner when that comes out so and i don't have this kit uh from planner phase because oh that fashion person is so cute um yeah i didn't pick up the kit because i'm not massively into true crime um but the fact that i can use it for <laughs> only red is in the building is so perfect so thank you tammy that's just ugh. um and then we'll go through the other kits first and then we'll come back to all of the other stuff that tammy sent me because she's just so cute. So she sent me Christmas Market, which is um, one of my favourite mysteries that Anna and I ever did, which was art by Kinnish Jess. <laughs> and this was the first Christmas one we ever did. Is that right? I think. Um, and yeah, it's Christmas Market themed. And so I have extras for this anyway from when I did the kit the first time. So to be honest, I may just merge them all together because um, that's in my, my B6 album anyway. So I'll probably put them all in there so that I could do the spread again. Uh, I just yeah thank you tammy it's just so kind of you to send me this and there's just like multiple sheets and we've even got the glitter add-on twice i don't know how tammy ended up with so many of these things but yeah so cute um and again tammy would have known that's okay i loved and then one of my other favorite mysteries we ever did was special day and i, I yeah having this is amazing i haven't done this spread yet um i I'm still waiting to decide for the for the perfect week for this one. Um, and there's there's a lot of discussion with like me and Anna about what this is for. So Anna's idea for this was that it was for a birthday. I think it leans very wedding. Um, so I might use it for that. Uh, I also think it leans baby shower because it's got blues and pinks in it. Um, so it's so versatile, you know. Um, <laughs> so I love it. And having more of it is just amazing for me because... It's just always really useful. So thank you, Tammy, for that. It's just... I love looking back at the heart we've done. Anyway, I need to not get emotional. So these are all the things I knew were coming uh, from Tammy. So these are... Um, it's mostly Stick With The Planco 
and um, I think there's some coffee monsters Co. in here um but it's basically stickers that Tammy was no longer using that she sent on to me so uh I love squidge <laughs> I love 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 squidge I love using squidge in my planner and these stickers are all stickers that I really need and will use so squidge has a headache sadly common for me I have headaches most days we have squidge is angry <laughs> which is perfect because I actually don't have a lot of angry stickers for someone who's <laughs> quite an angry person I don't have a lot of angry stickers um so that's perfect these are bigger squid has a headaches uh we've got these coffee monsters co headache ones i mean i'm hoping you won't get this many headaches but it's very useful to have i had to i had to get these i have the um, other inside out stickers i think but i didn't have the sheet of sadness ones and i very much identify with sadness from inside out so the fact that i could now just mark sadness whenever i want so cute these ones are some of my favorites these are emoti heads and i yeah i love these um i use those a lot these are once more with love more headache stickers <laughs> uh these ones are so cute these are some fruit ones which i just thought were adorable i think i have these already possibly um but they're so cute squidge loves reading we all know i love reading and so i had to pick up <laughs> the reading stickers from tammy these ones are squidge reads lots of books i'm pretty sure i don't have these ones but these are like all different genres so cute should we see if i can work out what they are so we have yeah like true crime but i would use these smart cozy mysteries R historical fiction <sighs> travel fiction <laughs> uh sci-fi fantasy <sighs> broken heart romance this is like maybe more contemporary romance and horror um but yeah so cute i love i i read a lot of genres so very cute these ones are squidges freezing the penguin <laughs> that's so cute yeah i mark a lot of like it's really cold or it's really hot so very useful and these are lottie stickers that are too hot i also got these teeth ones because i'm getting low on teeth ones and these are adorable once more with love um teeth munchkins these ones are for very hot as well again i do mark that a lot these ones are from coffee monsters co very cold i love all the little ice cubes um these ones are so cute these are e-reader ones and i don't know that i have the e-reader stickers from planner face I, I like because i think these came out before i got my kindle so i don't have the e-reader ones so when when tammy was like going through all the stickers she was like hey, you need these i was like you're right tammy i do uh because i read predominantly on my kindle these days uh these ones are so cute they're like fast food ones always very useful these ones are salad ones trying to be in my salad era <laughs> um these ones are also fast food ones so cute and i don't have those um these ones i don't have either these are also like like pizza ones I, I don't even recognize those and these are more um too hot ones i love the one in the fridge that's so cute so yeah uh, just a massive shout out to tammy again for sending me these it was so kind of you you didn't need to do it but you are an absolute amazing person for doing it so thank you thank you thank you um so that is everything oh, cellos everywhere now that is everything apart from the mysteries so if you uh if you want to click off now that's totally fine um but otherwise we'll start with the scribble prince code january mystery um so i will spoil it for you in three two one friends it's the daisy kit <laughs> so i am no longer a subscriber to the spc mystery not because i don't want to be because again if the conversion rate was better i totally still would subscribe i they're all exclusive art uh, a lot of them are by jess and yeah i uh, or, or dusk who i also love um i'm pretty sure this one's dusk and i yeah i would subscribe but i can't i just the conversion rate guys <laughs> just sucks so i unsubscribed probably about a year ago and when i saw the reveal video for this i messaged anna and i was like have you seen the reveal video <laughs> and she was like no no i guess i'll watch it and i was like anna <laughs> i need you to go and watch it and it's a daisy birthday <laughs> or a daisy party um so it's me in a kit and i i like sobbed <laughs> when i saw this so i want to give a massive shout out to cafe with anna who sold me this kit and a massive shout out to elisa from plan with elisa because i put up a story being like is anyone selling this and elisa messaged me like straight away and was like anna is selling it um so thank you <laughs> to both of you for making it possible for me to have this kit okay that's enough gushing so this is the ultimate kit i do prefer the ultimates from the spc mysteries because you get more you can use them over multiple weeks and i also do have the foil because it's daisy themed so i mean this is just cat in a kit you know i just like look at this spread with like the daisy table and the daisy cake and the cupcake and i need this dress like if anyone knows what dress this is like i need it um i love the flowers i love everything about it so 
yeah, I need to decide if I'm going to use this for my birthday this year. I also think this could work for a wedding, uh, 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 like a more kind of outdoorsy wedding. I also think for a baby shower, for like any kind of party, this is a really good one. So I'm not 100% sure if I'll use it for my birthday this year, but I probably will because like it's Daisy themed. Um, we are looking for this for Anna. Um, we haven't got it yet. So if you are also selling this kit, um, could you let me know or let Anna know? Because <laughs> Anna wants to use it as well so we can twin <laughs> for my birthday week or whatever. Um, so yeah, if you could let Anna know, that would be amazing. So yeah, um, we have this, like, look at the, dr I need the dress, people. Like, I need this dress also. Like, <laughs> daisies are just my whole life, you know? Um, so the colours are like very, very pastel. Um, I'm, I would have liked a yellow. Or maybe there's an additional colour um or a, or an orange they're like quite muted colors and i would have probably liked the yellow and an orange in there but i'm a yellow and orange girly you know uh so yeah very very cute so there there is an additional 15 millimeter um i'm not really entirely sure why but it means you can pick pink or blue um which again if you were using it it's like a baby shower one it could be cute oh okay andrea got me she's fine she knew <laughs> the yellow is the additional color so we've got the doodles there and then we've got a toolbox perfect for a quote like the parky scene um and then we've got the fashion person with a the third gorgeous daisy dress featured in this kit i need all of these outfits so cute so i will use this one because this is the one that most looks like me and then we have the kid boxes which they are looking very glammed up with these kids <laughs> um so yeah very cute i'm not sure that i will use the kid boxes um because like especially if i use it for me but like there's many many kit boxes um but yeah i'm not 100 sure i'll use the kit boxes we've also got this one which would be perfect for a quote we've got additional pattern boxes in daisies which is perfect the donuts like it's just so cute okay so massive shout out to anna coffee with anna anna and alicia uh alisa alisa um and then yeah it came with uh this daisy bundle so i will you know be using this and it's in is this light gold I should know and don't. I think this, I would call this light gold um, or matte gold. It might be matte gold. I don't know. But anyway, it's a daisy bundle and it will bring in the like goldy colours. So I think it's perfect. I will obviously be using it with this kit. I don't know that I will use the underlays because they are very bold, but they are daisy themed. So I don't know. But like I have bougie i can bring in if not. So we'll see. Um, then we've got this page with the doodles. These have been changed. I don't know if I've had um, many foil bundles since these have changed. I think I have had some, but like it's got a ring now and a Mickey head. Uh, and then the Baltimore she is my whole life. <laughs> so, yeah, so excited to have that. Um, and then last up, we have the January mystery from Planner Face. So again, if you don't want to check this one out, then please click off now. But otherwise, I will spoil it in three, two, one. Friends we're on top tier mysteries for january so this is bluebell wood and uh if you don't know i do help anna with the planner face mystery so i help come up with themes mood boards kip art lists write stuff for artists whatever help with all that stuff and i came up with the idea for this kit when kind of near me there's um a, a bluebell wood literally I'm like, how else can i describe it but no it's a bluebell wood and last year i was just walking around the park and came across the Bluebell Wood and Stuart and I used to go and visit it in lockdown. And I took some pictures and I messaged Anna and I was like, mystery theme? Question mark. <laughs> and immediately Anna was like, no, we need to do that. That would be amazing. So most of this work uh, is Anna's like to, to finalise it um, because we needed a lot of scenes for this one. So Anna had some really good ideas for the scenes. Um, I was just kind of the initial like stuck a load of <laughs> Bluebell and lavender and stuff like um themes in uh at the original point but yeah i i love this i absolutely love it i love the colors the purple and green combo purple and green is one of my favorite color combos so we've got the gorgeous picnic this dress neat uh we've got like some like blueberry bread muffins something like that um this book the deer the boat i mean it's just this gets everything uh we've got some like flowers in the um watering can really cute i mean that could be my hair i'm i'm i kind of want a curly fringe now like i used to have a curly fringe when i was younger and hated it because it so wasn't in but now like curly fringes are in so i don't know whether i'll get a fringe cut in but yeah 
Look at the colours. This kit is everything. I'm so excited. Look at the pattern. Bosh and washi. So cute. Uh, this was the die cut that came with it. Very cute. I'm going to put that in my uh, little pile up there so I don't lose it because I do lose the die cuts. Well, I don't, but they kind of just go everywhere. So the mystery format is always very generous. You get a lot. So uh, did I say I get these gifted for free? I don't think I did. I get these gifted for free for helping with the mystery. So yeah, we've got alternates of the feet, <laughs> alternates of the hands here. Um, that's right, isn't it? Yeah. Um, we've got alternates of that box that we've already seen. Again, I need that dress. The decos and the doodles. Oh, so cute. We've got the 15 millimeter, which is a wood pattern. The tool box. Look at the hair. Look at the hair. I wish my hair looked like that. Oh, so cute. So cute. We've got the glitter add-on, the box add-on, which I don't normally purchase, but with the mystery it comes with. And then the gorgeous Bluebell Wood double box. Perfection. Perfection. Um, and this is the like special mystery sheet. So yeah, I'm obsessed with it. I hope that you love it. I I love seeing a theme that I came up with in a kit like it's just very cool okay working for anna is very cool <laughs> um so i do also get the journaling kit gifted for free as well because anna's amazing like that so again we have the die cut there so i get two of the die cuts now so the mystery journaling kits are a bigger format which i love it means you can use them over multiple weeks um or you can do a really really gorgeous sticker heavy spread so we've got sheet one sheet two Ooh. that's my favorite sheet of the journaling kit is, is sheet two sheet three which is so cute with like the flowers and stuff and sheet four is on a washi paper so it's a bit thinner absolutely beautiful so gorgeous so excited to use that so um i don't know when this video will come out so i don't know which mystery will be next the february mystery it will have passed we've already passed it at the point of filming this but the february mystery is one of my favorites of all time um it's a theme that everyone has been so excited for i can't wait for you to see it you will have seen it by the time this video comes out um so i can't wait for you to see it but yeah it's a very exciting year for mysteries um we have some themes that we have been wanting to do for a long time and anna and i were actually talking about may's mystery yesterday and the theme that we're going for is a theme that i've wanted to do for a while so i'm really really excited to show you all that um this is just be so cute so yeah if you want to subscribe to the mystery the mysteries open on the 25 of the month 25th of the month before and close on the first um and there is a monthly rolling subscription which is slightly cheaper or there is one-off purchasing and we have standard vertical mini kit and journaling kit so you can purchase multiple if you want to if you ever have any ideas for mystery themes please do message me um we need an injection of mystery ideas because we've we're we're ahead by a lot um but we are looking for some more ideas for mystery themes um so if you do have any ideas for mystery themes if you can drop me a message either comment down below or message me on instagram message me on instagram is probably better it's easier for me to keep track of it um but if you could let me know if there are any mystery themes you're particularly interested in, we can't do them all i want to some of you <laughs> have requested very unique things we can't do them all but we are very interested in your ideas so please let us know um but yeah that is everything for this video so i'm gonna film my outro now this was so hard <laughs> to fit into frame like i didn't realize how many things there were but thank you so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed this video i will link to all of these shops in the description down below if you enjoyed this video i would really appreciate a like and if you haven't already i would love it if you would subscribe in the description i'll have a link to my instagram and my goodreads which are my most active social media so if you want to check out any other content from me that's the best place otherwise i'll see you in my next video bye